Welcome back, folks, to more Serpent Isle. All right. Now we have a henchman to help us. You can wear the stick, asshole. I don't even know what the hell that is attacking me. But he's fucking dead. Create food scroll. And another golden butt nugget. Well, I made a whole lot of food. Get our automaton a uh, little bit of armor. Hello, good sir. It's a bat. Some rats and bats are nice, nice, and some aren't. Gargoyle attacking! And getting fucked up. Where are you going? Uh oh, we got another mage. Another shady character. What's that? Blood spawn and the 
be cool if you could sell reagents. There's some mandrake root. Also, sulfurous ash, which looks like black cauliflower. Oh, you want to get some? out of my way. Yeah, we really don't need that shit. It's a jar! I wish to speak with thee. Oh, by turning into a fucking animal and attacking me? Thou shalt not have my reagents. Better fucking run. She's still doable. I am Stefano, late of Moonshade, an obtainer of rarities. I was unjustly imprisoned here, my lord. I freely admit that I am no fighter, but I have a quick wit and information that should help us pass out of this foul place. Perhaps if we join together, we shall have some small chance. Sure. Thou and I will do good together. Give me the information so we can get the fuck out of here. Somewhere within this labyrinth there are two switches that must be thrown at the same time in order to continue to the exit. I do not know exactly where they are, but I am sure it will be apparent. Without me to aid thee, thou hast no chance of winning free of this place for all thy prowess, and without thee, I have no hopes of surmounting what lies in the next room. Uh, do you not see the automaton standing next to me? I really don't need you. One of the things I bless about my peculiar line of work is the inability, is the ability to move silent, my lord. It may be the only thing that saved my life this time. When I came into this room, I heard some sort of commotion in the next room. When I sneaked into the entrance, I saw a mage, a very, very large monster, before I ran back there. Last time I looked, there was still in there. I, I, I think it was a dragon. Please, my lord, you must let me join thee. Without my aid, you can't hope to escape, and I'm no fighter. Without thee, I'm a dead man. I did not recognize him, but by the robes, I judged him a mage. I have heard that a few foolhardy mages have attempted to sneak in these tunnels in search of Stoneheart. Few who ever tr tried to ever return to the outside world. It is forbidden to possess Stoneheart, my lord, and for a good reason. 
It is the basis for which the agent that fueled Baal of Asculio's spells, and some say it can steal a man's wits. It is very dangerous. I'm not sure I can speak of it here, in this awful place. Old Federbiblio uses it as a tale to frighten novices, and I'll admit that it made an impression on me. Vasculio was an adept who lived outside of the strictures. He tortured and killed without restraint, using death agony to feed power into his spells. The council put him to the death, but his power had grown beyond even that limitation. They found his grave empty not long after the burial, and they say he still wanders the world looking for new victims. The strictures are the rules that all mages must obey, novice and adept alike. They address what experimentation can be done, what reagents can be used or sold, things like that. The strictures are meant to keep mages from abandoning all bonds of civilized behavior in pursuit of knowledge. As thou should know, my lord, there are some things in the world that would be better unknown. Let's talk of rarities. I'll admit that the title covers quite a bit. Scrolls, magical apparatus, lab equipment, reagents, anything that the client thinks is of value. That's what I mean by rarities. Wands, crystal balls, shit like that. Of course I'll never admit to anything specific. I value my life too much, unless I'm actually caught in the act. No one can prove anything, and I stay alive a bit longer. Thou might say it's a game of sorts. Client. Oh no, ask no more. I guarantee my client's complete secrecy. If I ever forget that promise dealing with mages, I'll be a very dead very fast. Or at least I hope I'll be dead. There are a few drawbacks to knowing anything about magic, my lord. All the alternatives to being dead come too readily to mind. Some healing potions. Won't fit. Oh, shit. What you got? Plate armor? If you're not going to fight, you don't need plate. Here, take that. These fur boots suck. Give me those. You wear the fur boots. You look gay. I am booked. This is a mess. What the fuck? I got about a key. Really? You're holding a sword in one hand and a gold nugget in the other. It's a bit strange. Like a pimp, snow leopard pimp. I know you ain't holding my damn death sword, son. At last, 
You have found the Avatar. I thought that I was free of thee when that strange lightning teleported me to this place, but now we are joined and I shall remain with thee until thou must release me. I have fulfilled the task thou didst set for me back in Britannia. Did I not serve thee well on the Isle of Fire? Thou didst not bind me for the service in another land. Thou should release me from my prison. Wilt thou? No. The journey into this realm weakened thy hold on the Avatar. Beware. If thou wilt not release me honorably, I will have my vengeance upon thee if I escape. But perhaps thou wilt have need of me yet. Black Sword of Death and Doom. I got Black Sword of Doom. Now I will fuck you up. Thou dost not possess the skill or power enough to overcome the madman Rothondo thou must face. I do. But not within the constraints of this gym, which shall it bind me. Free me, and I shall help thee win free of this place. Free, free, free at last! Thou art a fool, Avatar. Thou hast no idea what thou hast lost. I thank thee for thine ignorance. <laughs> I don't care, as long as you kill that punk ass mage. Now there might be a way to trick the game into keeping the demon sword, but you'll actually uh, find stronger. The serpent serpent sword, I believe, is stronger. Of course, you can't do instant death on people, but that's kind of cheap, and I don't use it anyways. Dead baby? What the fuck? Make sure you hang on to the sword. Dracolich? That ain't cool. You're a puss. Man, so we're gonna use some potions there. Hello, great heal. It's a good scroll to have. There's a key as well.
A fire doom staff, you don't say. Yeah! Now we're talking. I'm getting the fuck out of the mountains of freedom. This place is fucked up. These dead ass bodies. The fuck is wrong with this guy? Hello. Hello. They don't really need poison. There we go, now we're talking. Now Stefano! Yay! Get the fuck out of here. That was not cool. We are victorious. Come on, you can get around the body. Cold blast and telekinesis. Well, obviously, we're going to need those. We got another mage coming to play. Oh, man, you can't use fireball spells right. All right, I went ahead and reloaded. Since uh, my dumbass. Decided to put the Fire Doom staff on my character. I guess that doesn't work if your party's all attacking. Doesn't feel too good. I went ahead and give the automaton the black sword for now.
out of there. Why the fuck are you attacking me? some kind of curse shit on me. That's right, bitch. Fuck, are you attacking me? Attack the fucking bad guy, you retard. There you go. Holy shiitake. I'll go ahead and use the scroll so I don't use my magic. That's never good. Oh. I just got a big old two handed sword. Way to teleport, guys. I don't know how you did it. But it was fucking cool. Alright, this is a kind of strange room here. Need to pull these levers in a certain order to solve various puzzles and various scenarios here. First, you're going to want to flip the top right lever here in a row. And the bottom. Please help me. Lead me to my nightmare. Okay. Wake up, girl. <laughs> Dost thou crave a carrot? I sure do, bitch. How about some hooves to your face? Alright, so we got a key and some carrots. We're going to assimilate the key. Bunny rabbit, you want some carrots? I 
20. And here's that reward. Alright, a bouquet of flowers. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. I appreciate that. Alright, and that about wraps it up for this vid, folks. Stay tuned for more Serpent Isle soon to come.